So in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the case card feature in CodeApp and how to switch back and forth between case tables and case cards. So here I'm using the domestic house cats example data set, and I've opened it up into the default view, which is showing the table. Uh, it's actually a hierarchically structured table. So on the left, uh, we have the sex of the cats, and then below that, we have each individual cat. So I can click on, say, female and highlight only the female cats or male and highlight only the male cats in the table. So you may have noticed uh, in CodeApp tables, there's this little icon on the top left. If you mouse over it, it says switch to case card view of the data. And if I click on it, the icon, and select that option, the table goes away and this appears. Uh, so if you don't have anything selected in the table, uh, this case card view is going to show you a summary of the full data set. Uh, and this works for, for hierarchical, um, hierarchically structured tables um, as well as non-hierarchically structured tables. Um, so at the top here, we see uh, that the cats can be either male or female. And then below that, uh, we see that there's 24 cats. Uh, there's three possible values for eye color. Um, the cats range in age from 1 to 18, etc. Now what you can do with this case card view is click on these arrows or triangles uh, to cycle through the cases uh, in the data set. So let's say I'm interested in female cats click the arrow to get to female cats. And now below, uh, I see that there's 12 uh, female cats of the, the 24 in total. And I can go through by clicking the arrows and see the information for each individual female cat. So, and, and focus on each individual cat um, or case without having to look at all the data for all the cases in the data set. So I see here, uh, Lady Jane Grey is one of the female cats. She's four years old, etc. Another nice thing about the case card view is you can add a case as well, or add as many cases as you want. Um, so I'm just gonna show an example of doing that. Click on add case, and I'm going to add a female cat named Lily who is 10 years old. Um, I'm not going to bother with all the other information. Uh, oh, it got me out of there. So I'm going to just go back to make sure that she got entered properly. Yep, there she is. So, and now if I want to go back to case table view, all I have to do is go to the icon in the left corner again. And as I mouse over it, it says switch to case table view of the data. So I'll click on it and select it. And you can see here, uh, the full table is back. And uh, that case that I added in the case card view is here as well.